Good morning, it's April 17th and today we have the markets down, we have bond yields up and we have a lot of oversold signals on the Longboat platform for some treasuries and ETFs related to treasuries. So let's head over to Longbow. What do we here see here today? I am showing you the spine, we're in the middle of the range. So that's obviously the S&P 500 ETF. But then below that, I give you a whole bunch of oversold and near oversold signals. So the shy is the one to three year treasury ETF, very close to the oversold range. But then you have um, more of the seven to 10 year, 20 plus year. So IEF and TLT oversold EDV, so the extended duration ETF oversold zeros, oversold aggregate bond ETF, oversold tip, oversold <laughs> the BNDD hugging that green line. So really close to being oversold. And then EMB, so emerging market bond ETF oversold. So what does that tell you today? Um, should you be um, selling? No. Um, if you're thinking that you want a long-term ETF related to treasuries or fixed income, today may be your day. Um, obviously, you know, there's some concerns that there's some strength in the market uh, for both consumers and corporates, which means there could be a couple of more hikes than people have been pricing in and maybe not those cuts. And when that happens, yield goes up and it means that uh, bonds or fixed income go down. And that's really what we're seeing today. Also, you can tell that uh, the tech names are down. There's some obviously earnings coming out, but also you see that these things are going hand in hand, just like last year. So longer duration coming down along with tech. Really simple patterns, but what it does is if you miss the first um, decline in rates, meaning that your bonds are the ones you should have bought, uh, we're rallying, this may be your opportunity. So you can take a look here. Lots of these oversolds are neutral on the short term, and then you have some bullish on the intermediate term. So you've got that for the Short and shy, you've got the IEF. Um, you still have really for the long duration, it's bearish, um, but you've got bullish and neutral in other places. So again, if you're looking to be entering, today's a good day on that front. We'll catch you back tomorrow, obviously full of earnings seasons, lots of patterns that I think we're gonna be able to recognize for you to make your decision-making a little bit easier.